So I want to tell you a little bit about storage inside your motorhome and what you can do. I mean we all know what it's like, you've got bottles flying all over the place as soon as you drive off, there's not enough room for things and what you can do is you can use a system like this to uh, assemble on your walls of your motorhome to put your stuff in. Now how does this work? We have this which is made of a polyurethane based elastomer. It's extremely strong. It's stronger than the stuff you have in your clothes, you know, in your underpants and or whatever. It will last and last a very long time. The technology comes from chairs which are used in offices. Now these chairs may last 10, 15 years, they're in use constantly. So and they don't come back. So this is the sort of thing which is now being applied to motorhome technology. Now, how does this work? Well, you get one of these and you put it on the wall. We'll show you that later. So, what can you use it for? Well, here, for example, tablet goes in, it's held in like that, there's a bar along the bottom, you're driving along, it's not going to fall out. What about your mobile home? phone? Well, you can drop things on the floor as well, put the mobile phone in there and it will stay in there as the car is moving. You can maybe in your garage put some of the stuff that you need to keep your car clean, your oils, your fluids, tools, maybe your sandwiches. You can put them all in there and they will stay in there and it will be held in. You can have it without something at the bottom, magazines, books and the like, with something in the bottom. Hold your waffles. Maybe a bar along the bottom, hold the computer in so you don't have to worry about it falling out. Now, what we'll do now, we'll put a couple of them in my vehicle and we'll see how it turns what out. What we're going to do is we're going to put a little bit of storage up against this wall. So this is the place where one normally sits, but there's a cushion here, so I'm not touching the back wall as a rule, and that is a good place to put a little bit of uh, storage. Obviously as well, we can hang coats, the jackets go over the top here. I think that's a good place to put it. This is a template, so we're putting this on the wall. A uh, bit of sellotape, uh, hangs it up, and then we'll know where the holes have to be drilled. This is indicating the positions where the screws have to go. finished. So what we can now do is we can put some books in. A copy of this. I contribute to this so you can see some of my stuff in there. History book. And of course you can put some magazines, something like that, maps or whatever you want for your journey. So we've got the holes marked now where they're going to be drilled.
very nice. So now we can use this for example, we can put shoes in here, or well, sandals in this case, like that's what I normally wear when I go out. I try to be somewhere that's warm. Of course you could try putting your more formal shoes in there. I don't like to go into my van with my shoes on at all, so from now on I'll be able to take them out of here and go out. Now, I've got my cooker here, I can want, might want some olive oil, I can keep my olive oil down there. Now the olive oil is not going to fall out when the vehicle's moving because we've got this plastic element here, so let's put the olive oil in. Now alternatively you might have some wine, you might have some vintage champagne, which is just the sort of thing a camper van should always have. Put the champagne in there, look at that, and it fits, and it'll uh, stay there as the vehicle is moving, because this is really strong stuff.